Welcome to Show Me Cables. Today we'll be taking a look at the commonly used, but often confusing, DIN connectors. This is the 3-pin mini DIN male solder connector. To install, you will need the following items. Low voltage cable, wire strippers, solder and soldering iron, and the DIN connector. Start by inserting the plastic boot over the jacket. Measure how far you will need to strip back the jacket by holding the cable up against the base of the connector. Then strip the cable jacket using the wire strippers. For this example, we will be using Cat5e cable. You will also need to strip the individual conductors. Trim off any additional conductors if needed. Now comes the hard part, soldering. If you are new to soldering, it is recommended to find someone who's more experienced for the best results. There are three solder points on the connector, corresponding to the pins at the front of the connector. Be aware, there is not a standard wiring for DIN connectors, and the wiring can widely vary between different devices and applications. Please consult any wiring information you have available to determine which conductors should be wired to each pin. After you have soldered the necessary points on the connector, place the metal shell around the pins. Then, attach the plastic shell. The strain relief tab should be seated into the plastic shell. Squeeze the strain relief tab onto the cable jacket and slide up the boot. Congratulations, you've successfully installed the 8-pin Mini DIN male solder connector. For all of your cable and connector needs, choose Show Me Cables.